Good morning, everyone. Gary from DIY Electronics. Today, what I'm going to be um, showing you how to do is on your ADT system, your SafeWatch 3000, uh, Vista 10, Vista 20, Vista 50, um, the Vista series, or the ADT panel. They're all the same panel. It's uh, all, of, all of them are made by Ademco, and they're within the Vista system. I'm going to be showing you how to um, change your exit and entry times on your delay door. Um, there are situations where um, maybe you had an injury or something like that, and you need a little bit more time to come and go out of your house without the alarm going off. Um, so if you don't have a wireless key fob and you're dependent on your, your keypad to arm and disarm it, this is a good thing for you to um, either increase or decrease, if you wanted to, your uh, entry exit times. Now, um, you got to have the understanding that the very lowest entry exit times that you can have on a Vista system is 30 seconds. You cannot go any lower. Um, there are situations where I would, I would like it lower, but um, 30 seconds is the norm. And four minutes is the top. Now, I don't there are situations where somebody would like four minutes say that they have an overhead garage door that is on a delay and it's you know they get real bad weather they can hit their overhead garage door it'll initiate that time delay they'll be able to drive their car in close the door get out of the car go over and hit the keypad within four minutes you know there are situations like that but guys you got to understand that you have that for four minutes, that means if, say that a burglar pries open your garage door or kicks in your front door, they have four minutes also in that house before the alarm will go off. All right, so just keep that in mind. But there are times, like I said, if you, you had an injury and you needed more time to get in and out of your house, this is how you would adjust it. Now, I'm gonna show you on the two keypads how to adjust it. I'm going to show you first on the ADT hostage keypad. That's the fixed English keypad. I'm going to show you how to adjust your times. And then I'm also going to show you on the uh, custom English keypad uh, on how to change the times. So let's get right into it. Now, oh, let me just back up for a second. To do this, you have to know what your installer code is. Not the code that you turn the system on and off with. The actual installer code that grants you access into the program. If you don't know what your installer code, um, go through my other videos and I show you how to get that installer code out of the system. Because the, uh, the code is usually pri 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 proprietary and ADT doesn't want you to know what that code is. But I have a video showing you how to find out what it is. And you can actually change it and keep ADT out of your system. All right. So anyways, let's get right to it. I'm going to show you first. Uh, right now, my alarm system is set at 30 seconds out and 30 seconds in. I'm going to change it to 45 seconds out and 45. No, I'll leave it at 30 seconds uh, on the way in. Um, so the first set of numbers that you uh, set in the system is your exit delay. The second set of numbers that you input is your entry delay. Make a mental note of that. The first set out, second set in. So I'm going to make mine 45 seconds out and 30 seconds in. And again, right now it's set at 30 30. So let's get to. Oh, I got to turn you around. <laughs> I was like, hey, what's going on here? So here's your ADT hostage keypad. So now you have to know what your installer code is. Mine is 4112. Yours could be different, but mine is 4112. So to get into the system, you go 4112800. Okay. That brings you right into the um, position 20, which is your installer code. Now, if you want to find out what the existing entry and exit times are, you hit pound three five. Three zero, three zero. 
So right now, my entry exit times are 3030. 30 seconds out, 30 seconds in. Now, I want to change that to 45 seconds out, 30 seconds in. So what you do is you hit star, three, five. And then remember, your first two numbers are your exit delay. So I want 45 out, and your second number is, your second number is the entry. So I just made mine 45 seconds out, 30 seconds in. So now to get out of program, you hit star nine, nine. All right, we're out of program. So now I've got a, 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 a contact sit right here that is programmed uh, as a delay door. Let's pretend that this is my front door. So let's arm the system. One, two, three, four, away. All right, I go out the door, I close the door. So now we wait 45 seconds. Do, 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 do. Actually, you could actually count the numbers. Every beep is a second. Do, 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 See, 45 seconds, guys, is a long time. Here we go, the last 10 seconds. Remember, it has that double, triple beep. Alright, so that's 45 seconds. And then I open the door. And now, of course, it starts... It's our system now. Of course, it starts as 30 seconds in, and then you just shut it off. One, two, three, four, off. Disarm. Ready to arm. Now, I'm going to change it back to 3030 um, on the custom English keypad. Oh, that was an old alarm I had in there. Let me just clear that out. Okay, so basically, it's the same thing on the custom English keypad. You just go in the program, 41128. Zero, zero. All right, and then if you want to see what is in, um, you know, right now for the entry exit um, delays, you hit pound three five. And it, there it is, zero four, zero five is 45, and then it said zero three, zero zero for 30 seconds. So now let's change that back to 3030 on this keypad. So you hit star 35, and then you hit 3030. Zero, zero. All right, so now if you want to check your work to make sure it is 3030, watch these two numbers over here. I'm going to hit pound 35. All right, so it is set at 3030. So they say you want to set it for 6060. You hit star 35 and then you hit 6060. Zero, six, zero. Again, if you want to check your work, you hit pound 35. Six, zero, six, zero. And that's it. And then you just hit star 99 to get out. All right, guys, that is how you program a Vista series, ADT, First Alert, um, Brinks, um, laws as a Vista series. That is how you can adjust your time out and time in. Um, it's all through uh, making sure that you have your installer code and go to uh, position 35. If you hit pound 35 it'll tell you what's existing in there for your entry exit times and if you hit star 35 that's where you input your entry exit uh, numbers and just remember the first uh, set of two numbers that you put in is your exit your second set of numbers is your entry all right guys that's all i got for you 
uh, questions, comments, or and anything else that you want to know about the Vista series, leave me a message down below and I'll make a video on it uh, so we can share it with everybody. And uh, that's it, guys. So, um, uh, what is that? Like, ring the bell, and subscribe. And again, thank you guys for watching because it's all about you. Have a good day.